Mic test one, two, So, a little Hogwarts update for those who do not know. Still a lot of bags right here. A lot of stuff still happening here, clearly as you can see. So, oh, oh, oh! Yeah, look at this, okay? This is what we've got. These lights. So that's what we're looking at so far. You can see, I mean, the absolute detail of this thing is just insane. Those are like the glass doors that supposedly, and then of course the tower, these all spin here. Okay, kind of cool, this little thing. Um, and then of course that's where Dumbledore sits down. You can see the snake, Chamber of Secrets, but you can see the snake there, it kind of moves too. I just broke it, son of a tit. But yeah, and then of course we got, that's what it, and that's what it looks like from this side. And that's just some of it. I mean, this thing is absolutely insane how tall it is. So we've got some work to do with that, but she's coming closer and closer. I think what I'm gonna do is like the very last part that I get, I'm gonna like record it. Like I'm gonna go and then like zoom out and then it's gonna be like Hogwarts or something. I don't really know, but we've got that going for us. Um, in today's video, we're giving Maddie a lesson. And it's gonna be from the good, pretty much all of good good should be there. Grant's the one that's given the official lesson, so Maddie is super pumped about it. Are you ready for your lesson today? Yeah, I'm peeing at my back, getting prepared. She's getting prepared, mentally prepared. Dun 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 Listen, dun, 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 dun. me, we were all at the range yesterday, and Grant told me to do this one thing, small, and it completely changed. Everything. And then that's when we realized she needs a lesson from someone good. <laughs> I'm not saying Matt's not good. But you're saying Matt's not but good. But I am saying that I'm planning a bachelorette party right now and that it's not for me. We're not gonna talk about that, so I'm gonna leave Maddie in a dumpster. We're getting a cat! We are potentially getting a cat. A golf cat. A golf cat. And he's gonna have a little golf bag. Yeah. He's gonna have a little golf outfit. And you guys can shut your mouth. But no. We're gonna give Maddie a lesson day from Grant. It's gonna be really good. We're gonna set it up on the tripod. It's gonna be at night at Waters Creek. You guys are gonna see all the, the cool shot shapes she's gonna put on, hopefully. So stay tuned. It's gonna be kind of a shorter video, I'm sure. I'm gonna be editing this, so it's gonna be really bad. <laughs> so stay tuned for that. But I think at this point, you have already seen the match. The match is already out with me and Maddie, and that was absolutely insane. So I hope you guys have enjoyed that video because we played really well. And I think Matt is getting now prepared for the match with Steve. I think that's gonna be, that is gonna be one heck of a match. That's gonna be a lot of fun. So let's subscribe. Let's get to 200,000 subscribers because we're, we're really, really close. You guys have been slapping the subscribe button, but mainly let's get there before Steve. Cause you guys remember on the road to beat Steve to 200,000 subs. It's kind of sad that you guys are like fighting though. No, it's not sad. It's, 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 a, it's like a, a push for both of us. Like I want, I want you guys to subscribe to me as much as I want you to go subscribe to Steve. Subscribe to me first. Subscribe from subscribe to me first. Like go subscribe to Steve after I get to 200,000. <laughs> no, go subscribe to both of us. You guys, seriously, one of us is gonna end up with the big prize of potentially a brand new set of golf clubs or just like straight cash. I don't know what we're gonna do, but somebody's gonna win a big prize for 200,000. And then I think what we said me and Maddie were gonna do is like a, a match against Micah and Katie, uh, Mike and his wife. So that might be coming at 200,000 or just a crazy video for 200,000. So just stay tuned with us and continue to like and subscribe. You guys have literally been slapping. The subscribers have been going up like crazy. So thank you guys for that. We're gonna get to the golf course. We're gonna get to Waters Creek. And Maddie's gonna show us how good she's getting. So let's get there. Well, we have made it to Waters Creek Range. There is a storm of brewing over there. Grant has called the missile silos from Kansas and told them to pour rain down. So we are gonna try and squeeze this in before, before the destiny hits us. So we've got Maddie right here behind us. She's warming up right now. We've got Grant over here to sure. our destiny and, Gr and Garrett back there. He looks interesting. Recently. And essentially what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be giving Madison a lesson. Grant was kind of, he I will say, Grant was out here yesterday kind of helping her out. He gave her a couple of tips and she was starting to hit stuff like that. So then I was talking to Grant, I was like, you know what you gotta do? You just gotta give her a lesson. Right. And so that's exactly what we're gonna be doing. And Grant's just gonna kinda go through all the motions with her, kinda help her get dialed in, and uh, hopefully get her swing good enough to where she can start beating Steve on a regular. Right. And uh, that's it's, the goal. That's the goal. And it's just, I mean, he, he can explain it a lot better than I have. I've given Maddie some of the knowledge that I know, and Grant's gonna kinda take over and hopefully get her more dialed in than she already is. So, I mean, that's about it, Grant. Right, yeah, first, I mean, first off, I watched Maddie yesterday, so I kinda have an idea of what she struggles with and what we're gonna improve on, but. We act like I'm not here. Yeah, no. She's, she's, <laughs> so I know that starting out, Maddie is an athlete, which right. is good. So she's gonna make these changes quick. That, that's the that's the key right now, is that she can make these changes in one video. So we're gonna see some immediate improvements. Okay? Right, just like that, you guys. Like I said, we're getting right involved. Yeah. So starting out, like every lesson that I've done on YouTube, I like to watch a couple, and yeah. I want I want Maddie to have a target. Like, did, did I she? That's what I tried, to, I tried to tell her. Every oh. single time you come to the range. Pick a target. Yeah. 
He's my teacher, not you. Yeah, trying to trust me. You don't listen to me regardless. So this is not an alignment stick, but this serves the same purpose. It's just a club. We're gonna go. We'll go over the red flag. That's our direction. Okay. So you over keep your the feet. red. Yeah. See the red flag there. See that? You don't have to. You don't have to be right up against it. But oh. I mean, we can move the ball back if you feel like it's too far away. There we go. So you want your feet parallel to this stick. That's the idea. So we're going over the red flag. So just hit a couple shots. We're gonna look at it. See what she hits. I like your it. ball flight. Does that feel like in your mind it's not? Yeah. Exactly. That's good. Oh. <laughs> That's a good thing. That's a good back, thing. If you come back here, Maddie, if you want to step back here, you'll see it's perfectly right at the red flag, just a little bit left of it. You want your feet slightly left of the target. Oh. Yeah. yeah. Good job, Grant. Mm -hmm. Goodness, Gary, that was good. Okay. A couple more. Good. That's pretty good, honey. How long has she been playing? How long have you been playing, honey? A few couple months, yeah, I'd say about two. It's been on and off, like she hasn't really, you know, every now and then she'll, right. be, she'll be in some videos and stuff. Yeah, she that's, annoying. that's the miss, that's right the miss. there. Yes. That is the miss. So yesterday, when I was watching Maddie hit, she tends to hit behind the ball. Yeah. She takes a good divot. She takes a good divot, the, cl the club is coming in square, but she's losing her angle back here every time. She's casting a little bit. So if we can get Maddie's hands a little bit more ahead at impact, she's gonna catch that ball first, and then she'll start to hit some pure shot. Goodness, I love listening to somebody who knows what they're talking about. All right. One more, last one. Last one before I we dive into this. Before Grant starts taking over. Still, yep, just do your, do your everything. Alright. Hey, that wasn't bad. Alright, right. so what we're gonna do, first off, let's make sure this grip's good. So I'm gonna set this okay. club good. Let's get this pan, let's get it down in these fingers good. Perfect. Or now, that or yeah, that. that's no you can keep it right just offset. Now put the other hand on and then extend this forefinger. So this V right here is going up to your armpit. That's right. a perfect grip right there. And we're gonna push those hands slightly ahead. Weight is gonna start more on your left side. Boom, perfect. Now go ahead. Now go ahead. Oh my gosh, dude, that's the lesson of the day. Goodbye, crappy golf swing, Maddie. All right, again, good. She caught the ball first there, that's the yes, key. Yes, that's the goal. That's the goal. All right, same thing. There you go, good. Hands ahead, make sure that grips down on those fingers. Perfect. Now go ahead. Dude, I love that, Grant. I love the left. Left is such a better miss when someone's starting out than slicing it and pushing everything to the right. If you if someone's hitting to the left, you can correct that so quick. Right takes Tough. time. Right. Good news is she's never played softball or baseball, so you don't have to worry about right. having that garbage. Right. I know how annoying that can back. be. Yeah, yeah. yeah, they fall back through impact. So now she can get the perfect. Weight left. Perfect. We're going to look at the swing from here. Yep. From here. Yeah. My gosh, if you guys don't know that went dead straight, that looks really good, honey. Seriously. I would have my club right here. No, usually when you started out, so if you want to, Maddie, when she started out, her hands were kind of like this yes. a little bit. So she would dump the club back here. See how it breaks down? Yeah. You need to feel this, the hands lead. Like, so like he was talking about your left wrist? Yes. It's like dragging through. Right. So know? I thought for irons it was supposed to be here, but I guess I'm just supposed to be like this. Yeah, yeah. That's perfect. Oh. Right there. Just the hands a little bit ahead. And we're just, the goal is to catch this ball first, then the ground. It's not, you were doing this before, yeah. feel that? Now yeah. we're doing this, we're dragging it. There, that's impact, boom. Got it. And that's something Peter was, like when she got her first lesson with Peter, was like, he did a good job of telling her, like, you got to make in your hands through the right. ball. All right, we're going to cut that one out. Yeah, we're going to cut that BS out. All right, let's do it again. Perfect. Good. Perfect. There, that's right. You don't not necessarily that far over, but just right there. See how you can feel it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The best way to oh, do it. Oh, you can feel it right there. Right, exactly. You wanna oh. you wanna I always I can you can usually feel it the best. You want this resting on top right here. Ooh. There, like that. I'm Boom. getting a lesson. See that? Yeah, and yeah. And now yeah. you can take these fingers off and you have that support to hinge your wrist. A lot of people put the grip right up in here. That's dead. That's death. Death. Gotta get it right in those fingers. Right there. Boom. Right. Both faces square. Boom. That's a perfect grip. Now put your other hand on. Perfect. There it is. Boom. That's it. Weight left. There we go. There. Perfect. Okay. Oh my. A little thin. But we're catching the ball first. That's Dead the goal. Straight. Still better than. You hit that like 107. Hey, miles. the fat shots. You can't. That like you can get away with that on the course. Yeah, yeah. Right. The fat shots. Those are. They're not fun. We're gonna. I want to set it perfect every time. That's the key. Okay. Get it great in those fingers. On top. Boom. On the other hand. Boom. Perfect. That's it. Close. Close, close. What, okay. am I saying too close at all? No, that was good. 
Let's do it again. I want to get that grip a little bit stronger. So if you guys don't know, what Grant is currently focusing on is making sure Maddie's grip is getting perfect and making sure it's perfect every single time. And then she's just normal swing, swinging right through the ball. <laughs> My grip still needs work. Your grip. So don't squeeze it so hard. Yeah. Garrett likes a fat grip. Like, yes, oh. that's, a, that's what that's my coach taught me. He's like, nice little baby bird. If you had yeah, a bird yeah. in your hand, how would you hold it? No. You're going to squeeze it and crunch it, or you're going to let it swat right. in your hand. That's why everybody gets blisters in the beginning. is because they're like strangling yes. the thing. They're trying to right? hit it hard, you know? <laughs> Close. Close. It's okay. Again, we can get away with that. That's okay, progress that's forward. Hitting, that's hitting the upper half of the ball. So you still can hit down. You still got to hit down. Okay. Perfect. See, we, yes, that's what she, we like. She catches on quick. She does. She. That's really the one does. thing that I love about her is she knows how to go quick. Right. So. Huh? That you can get away with left. I like that left. I like it. So what have you learned so far? Okay, so I'm gonna put the club right here in my hands. Okay. So that it rests right on top. I'm not gonna squeeze it because it's like a baby bird. Baby bird. Make sure your hands are interlocked. Everything's good. Make sure you stand perfect. nice and tall. Yeah. Good. Stand perfect. Nice and tall. Now just hit down. I want to see a divot. Close. close. That was close. It's like a half a groove lower. You're not, what Maddie was doing in the beginning a lot was hitting a foot behind the ball. She's not hitting behind it now, but she's catching it actually a little bit thin, which is okay. Right. I would, if I were you, I would hold the club like this every time you grip it. So make sure it's square. Come in right in those fingers and on top. Boom. That's so it. Right there. That's your grip. Perfect. Perfect. See how this is sitting on top? Yeah, yeah. Boom. And right there. Right there. Boom. Perfect. Grab it like that. That's Love it. Love it. Every time. You got to make sure it's there. If it's not there, you're not going to hit it. I get that grip the same every time. Yes. It's okay. Go. A little better. There we go. That's when you're starting out, guys. Everybody, if you're not starting out with a good, fundamentally correct grip, you're going to make compensations in the swing. Right. Keep hitting down and through. Good. Do it again. Good. Good. That's it, honey. Do it one more time. Just got to get used to hitting down. Down. Perfect. People, when they're first starting out too, is they like to try and lift the ball. You got to actually hit down to make the ball go up. So you don't want to try and like lift it up in the air. That's what they call compressing. Compressing right. the golf ball. It's a weird concept. Kind of like, it is a weird concept. You got to hit down to make it go up. And a lot of people don't understand that the divot actually comes in front of the ball. Exactly. And, not, and they're trying to like make a chunky hamburger, greasy bubby patty. Right. <laughs> you know hamburger bubby? That boy takes divs. Damn. Oh my gosh, honey. That's what we you got to do right that? there. And that, that's your pitching wedge, and Grant, I guarantee that's over 100 yards. Oh, 100%. Maddie, Maddie swings a lot faster than the average girl, I will Literally. say that. Literally. Because you she guys work to, out a lot, too. Yeah, she wants to hit the ball far, too. It's like, oh, Ricky Bo it's like Ricky Bobby, but she wants to hit it far. Like, her goal right now is a 250-yard drive. Oh, we'll, we'll work up to the driver. Let's do it. Let's go. Oh. My gosh. Look, it's right at the flag. Get up there. Oh, go, my go, gosh. Go, go, go. That's like eight, nine feet, honey. Go. 61 chip in that water's creek. Week, we're gonna we're gonna move up to some clubs now. This this is just a pitching wedge, so we'll move up to like a seven iron, and then some drive. And then okay. you do that, dude. Grant, that was three beautiful shots in perfect. a row. Perfect, perfect. All right, let's move on to like a seven iron. Quick. I love Honey, seven good iron. job. You're doing wonderful. I'm gonna I'm gonna no offense to Steve, but Steve, I'm gonna outdrive you. What's Steve's drive? You can hit it 300. On the forward tees. <laughs> yeah, same everything, not too much thing, changes. Right, the only thing that changes when you go up in irons is the ball slightly moves forward in your stance a little yeah. bit more. Oh my gosh! The contact is so good right there. I'm telling you, if she hits center of the club face, dude, she's right. going to score low. That, that's probably in 100, I would say that's 145, 50 yard 7 iron. A lot of guys, that's hit, a a lot lot of guys <laughs> hit that. A lot of guys hit their 7 iron. Like you get to a PJ Tour, he's like, yeah, I got about 160 here, I'm hitting a full 8 iron. Yeah. That's big for a PJ Tour player. Yeah, and you're hitting the light 7 here. I'd probably say that's about 145, 150 for sure. Dude, that's crazy. I think I'm going to bring Grant to every single match we ever have. Grant's just going to be there to right. help Maddie. Right. Do I go here, 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 here? That depends. How do I, I know? For a stock shot, we're, we're just below this. For a what? For a, like a standard shot, we're just below this right here. So we're going to okay. grip it right here. I don't want you I don't want you way down, choke down. I don't want you off the end. So I never know because people are like, well, whatever feels right. And I'm like, right. I don't know what feels right. Exactly. There we go. Oh, my. Maddie. Behind that, but not. I mean, that was still right over the target. Wow. Good. That's that's a good miss hit. That was not your, that's not a perfect shot, but it's a great miss hit. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> that is so good, baby. How's my weight shifting? Because I oh, had a good. problem with that. No, in you're place. what you what Maddie does better than a lot of people is when she gets up to the top, she fires her hips. Thank the ball you, Matthew. More than anybody, she does clear. 
which yeah. you can't necessarily always teach that because some people use all arms. Mm -hmm. But Maddie actually, when she gets up, fires her hips, and that's where she gets a lot of that power from. If you turn through the ball and make sure you're just all you're focusing on is turning, the club will catch the ball. It will. It literally will. That's okay. That okay? Exactly. So when you hit that shot right there, Maddie. What you did through him, you went like this. So when you hit those to the right, you go through impact and you go this way with your hand. Yep. With the hosel. See how that went like that? Told you, many times. You gotta make sure though. So when you get through here, you can let that turn over. The club face turn over like this instead of going like that. You just led with the heel. Right. Exactly. Let that right. And hand that's turn. the main, like when Boom. I tell her, like, swing out towards your target. Swing right. towards the red. Exactly. The hands will naturally. Can't take a divot with an open club face. Right. Unless you're Bobby Golf, go. that was good. See, you did a little bit extra there, but that's okay. That's a way better. Gosh, that oh my so gosh, she's gonna be on the tour. And bit. compared to like you consistent, like remember us talking about you mentioned in the video. Can somebody tell me not to go right? This is your chance. There, I, right. I could not. Literally, exactly. and, and I could not figure out what it was. That was all to do with her grip. When yeah. I when we first started out, she had it up in this palm here. We've got to get it in those fingers, guys, right there. Then she can strengthen it. See, when you get I, it up in that palm, you can't release the hands. I never would have known that, honey. Right. It's part of getting somebody who knows what they're doing. All right, Maddie, you want to move to some drivers? You think you're warmed up enough? Uh, it's up to you. You're the lesson, man. But let's just move up to the driver. I want to see her hit this because she has some clubhead speed. I like it. Look who joined us. Look who joined us. <laughs> what? You're looking crusty. Steve's finally back from the farm. I love it. Yeah. You're getting one next, bull. <laughs> so, the one difference with the driver, do you know what it is? When you're hitting the ball, what is the one difference? With the driver versus the iron. Well, you, it does go more forward in your stance. Wise. Right, it does go more forward. <laughs> you're getting closer. But you're hitting slightly up on it. When she's saying slamming her hips, that makes her hit up on it. Angle of attack. Right, angle right. of attack. So we're just going to be trying to hit up on the ball. That's why it's on teeth. Right. Oh, I Yeah, see. we're not hitting down like an iron. You don't want to hit down on this and take a divot. We're so, just... is it wrong that Matt always tees up my pitching wedges? No. You can you can tee them up. Oh, yeah. Well, on a, I, I do it on part threes is what she's oh, saying. Oh, yeah, for part threes, of course, yeah. <laughs> we don't do it in the fairway, honey. Matty doesn't matter. We don't tee up your pitching wedge in the fairway when you're playing on a par four. <laughs> she's tested Matt, like, everything. She's like, Matt's doing this. Matt's teed up, like, <laughs> pitching wedge. Matt never told me the grip. Get over the ball. This is uh, just a very passive row session. Maddie to Matt. Yes, it <laughs> is. It's like, well, Matt it, told me to do this, and Matt told me to do that. It is. Grant's doing a great job. Grant's doing a wonderful job. <laughs> I stink. I feel like everybody could be giving Maddie a lesson but me. Right, huh? Perfect. Especially you, Steve. You're good at golf. Now okay. that. That's some height. That's, that's a little past you. Oh, 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 oh. He's trying to, he's teeing it up higher so she hits up on the ball. Yeah. You're terrified. I'm not scared at all. I'm going gun, gun. Okay. No, this match is going to be lit. <sighs> Who does she think she is? Dun, dun, dun. Okay. No, no, but it's still, I, I, we took the, dude, the lightning's awesome. I took the challenge. You better get better, though, because you, you're trapped. <laughs> it gets you in a good spot. Okay, let's do it again. He tries to be mean. <laughs> he can't. He's too sweet. He's too kind. All right, so what happened? What just happened? Oh, why did it go up? Why'd you go, why did it go straight up in the It's super high on the Right, but your angle of attack was down. So we need to hit up on it a little more. So when we get over okay. the ball, go ahead, get over the ball. I tried to teach her this once, yeah. but she didn't listen to me. The driver only, because we're hitting it off the tee. So okay. we want to hit up on it. Start with that setup. Perfect. Now just swing. Steve, you better watch out, boy. This thing go. How far is that green flag? <laughs> Bro, when Steve does a video, it's so fun. Right, just yeah, just a little bit. You don't need to like. It's only from here, like how you normally would. Set. So it kind of changes bit. my driver. Is that right, it's only with the driver because it's teed up. So we're trying to hit up on it like this. Okay. We're not hitting down. We're hitting up. So when I so when I do my shoulders, like if I was to be here, look at my driver. Right, you would want to like, hit down more. It, but like right. my driver goes like that. That's okay. That's okay. You're good. Oh. And your shoulders, you can keep the. Don't move your hands too much. It's just the angle of your shoulder. Setup looks great. Oh my! Just Dude. a little right. That was great contact. It literally is so good. Am I too far away? No, you look great. Looks good, Manny. Oh, Cut that out where I said you look great. That's gonna be the number one comment. You look great, Matt in the background. <laughs> okay, that was actually a better drive. What the <laughs> Bro, Grant's like a little ant just ready to crawl out of his hole. Colin, a lesson yesterday. He was hitting the irons great. We got the irons figured out, but the driver, it's just a separate golf swing and it takes time. Right. It really does. Because it's getting it's like, like this. You're going like this. Shifting too much? Right. You got to keep it right here. Close. That's okay. okay. That was a lot of speed. That was a lot of speed, honey. See, it. that was 90%. That's what I want you to do. A little 90% swing, Maddie. We're going to get you dialed in. Okay. I don't mean to be roasting you. I'm sorry. It's okay. Yeah, right? That's good. Yeah, right there. Perfect. Close. I'm trying okay. to draw my hand. You're good. You're good. Don't worry. Don't think about that right now. Let's just swing. When you get up to your top, I don't want you to shift too much this way 
I want you to stay right there. Boom. Feel that? Into that seat. Right. The side bend. Right there. Boom. Got it. Stay back. There. That was better. Close. Close. It's, it's kind so of hard close. for me to stay right. in my fall. But that's that's the key is adjusting from an iron swing to a driver swing, and that's what takes time. Yep. They're two different swings. They really are. But sure, the man. hybrid is like the iron? The hybrid is just like the iron. Exactly. Yep. You can hit down. All the clubs you're hitting down. Like three wood, you slightly hit down. Hybrid. Once you get to the driver, that's when you're starting to have a little bit of a reverse C here and hitting up. That's why people work 50% all of their clubs in the last round. Right. Yep. Exactly. Oh, that's better. You solid. went through the ball, Maddie. That was good. Just up on it. There. That's it. That would have been perfect. That would have been perfect. That would have been perfect, honey. I'm telling you, it's the same. It was the same thing with me, my, honey. My practice swings were always better than my real swings. Kind of sucked. There we go. See? There we go. That's dead straight, Madison. And yep. Athletes don't set up like this. They're right. Ready to like Unless you're a professional the swimmer. Athletes don't bend over. Right. Ah, Maddie with the jokes. There. That's it. Close. Dang it, that was so close, honey. I want, I want her to hit one or two good drives, and I think we'll be good. Yeah. Because the irons look great. She's just got to come out here and practice. Right. Close. That's a little bit oh downward on the angle of attack. See, like, Grant knows so much knowledge, yet he keeps it so simple to where Madison can understand, and that is right. what makes a good teacher. Because you'll get golf pros that literally ramble on about all this te technicality that right. people don't understand. It's, it's all about, like, where you're at with your game. She's just starting out, so we got to yeah. keep it simple. It's okay. That was talent. It hit her shoe. Did I? You did still advance the ball. Oh, that was good, Grant. There we go. A little baby cut on that. That's playable that in, really in, in gameplay. I want her, when she gets up to the top, is to stay right here and yeah. not move forward. Right. Like you're doing mostly on iron. Right. Oh, there was some speed, honey. Yeah. So what she's feeling, you'll you'll always get off balance a little bit if you get outside this right knee. And that's what everybody wants to do when they first start out is they slide like this. Yes. Instead of turn and yeah, you gotta feel those hip. You gotta feel it turn into this hip right there. Quarter one inches, sir. You're good. So turn. There. Yes. Then throw. Then throw. All right. You don't want to slide the hips. You don't want to do this. You want to turn. Good. What do I have to score to be in the LGBTQ? <laughs> You don't have to score anything, you just uh, feel it. Just kind of, one day you they'll, wake up. They'll call you. You know, you know, one day you just wake up and you feel like you're in the... Yeah. Do it again. It's okay. Do it again. Yep, do it again. you gave it a rip. That's what we like. She tried. She tried. I shifted, didn't I? Focus and hit this far. Yes. Oh! That was a little lower T, honey. That would have been money. That was a great swing. Good job. The higher it goes, the farther it goes. Right. No. I mean, the less farther Typically. it goes. Oh! <laughs> Dude! That is good. That's ball. That's good? That is ball. For, uh, that is ball. Maddie's position. I, I honestly got to say, though, Matt, whatever you've done with her, you've put her in really good positions. Yes. Gosh, that sounds sick. You put no, her in great positions. I understand you know? what you're saying. No. Because, well, again, the only thing I'm able to focus on are the hips. Right. Making sure that her hips turn back. Oh my gosh, do you see it like her hips? All right. Wait, why is it going right? She, honestly, it, the reason it's going right is because her hips are firing so hard. Yes. She's actually got to calm them down a little bit because she's getting here and boom, and the club's behind her. Yeah. So the club face is open. Eventually, this is just time of her coming and hitting ball. Eventually, this is just time of her coming and hitting ball. I really hope I got that. It was kind of blurry, Garrett, but goodness, is your chin hopefully hurting bad? No, that's going to hurt just really bad. See, for those of you who didn't see that, if, if it wasn't on camera, I was doing this little thing, this maneuver, and then hitting it off the top. I don't want you really and I hit it pretty hard in my chin, so. Garrett. All right, last one, Matt. Here we go. All right, let's come on, let's Madison. Go on oh, that was so close, though. A ripper, Magoob. We got to say one thing, though. If you made good contact, that would have gone far. Yes. Steve, mess up. Oh! 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 That's actually going far. Because that's got no go. spin. Oh, go. that's over. If I we don't end it on that, we're stupid. I think we're that's done. at we're least 230, maybe. We're done. Dude, no. Maddie. On a golf course with the hard fairways, that's rolling to 250. So what do you I think right there that was good? You just, that one you did Give not hit down on. 
she actually hits slightly up on that. You know how you didn't like hit the ground because this one right before you kind of took a divot with the driver. So yeah. you swept it, you hit slightly up on it. That's why it was so good. But she'll figure. I'm telling you guys, when you're when you're just some people catch on to golf really quick, and she's one of them. I, that was a really good lesson, Grant. Oh yeah, thank you for that. She yeah. she. I mean, I've taught her what I've known, what I know, firing the hips because I've always had a big problem with sliding. So I wanted to make sure Maddie did not slide and have the same problems that I did. Right. And Grant was able to come in here and find some things that I did not know. Mainly the grip. Grip was like 90% of it because I could not figure out why she was going right. I was looking it up, talking to you guys, trying to figure out if you guys knew. And Grant came in, took one look, and said, "It's your grip." We got that figured out, right. and now she can start hitting some good shots. Steve can go to the dumpster where he belongs. Maddie's just gonna continuously work. I want to thank Grant again, the boys for coming out, taking a look at Maddie's swing. I think we're just gonna set this up, and Maddie's just gonna hit some more shots to kind of end the video. And thank you, Grant. Of course, appreciate you having me on the channel. Yeah, that was a it was a wonderful day, and Maddie, you got a lot better. No, I have to use my own clothes anyways, but here's the deal. I still suck at golf. This is just like a one-off thing. I got lucky today. I'll wake up tomorrow, probably be getting back into it. Maddie, no. you suck. I can't. I suck? No, I can't. No, I can't even stop. What the heck? What is these? Dude, these are little Garrett okay. fingers, like the little alien things. They get... How did? You, how do you think your lesson went, honey? The lesson went great. I think the grip honestly changed, and also placement of the ball. My placement of the ball was very, like, very textbook without even, like, I don't know. I thought the ball for the, the whole ball position that we were doing, even for my irons, were completely different. There were like little tricks going more forward, going like that with my whatever. The grip was a big one. Um, I realized, and you can see it in a lot of my back videos. I would use Again, a really good lesson. We got to get a thumbnail and we got to get out of here. But the match between Steve and Maddie will be happening soon. I think me and Steve are going to have a little match because he says he stinks. So we're going to get something going here. But hopefully you guys enjoyed that. A kind of a quicker video. It's probably going to be about 13, 14 minutes long, hopefully. And, um, and hopefully you guys enjoyed. We really love you guys. Maddie, you're getting really good. Everybody's starting to notice how good she's getting, and she's going to start beating some of the good, good members if we're not careful. So thank you guys. Like and subscribe. On our way to beat Steve to 200,000, I'm telling you. Watch him shank this. Dang it, that was good. When can he start shanking him again? But thank you guys again. We love you. Keep watching the videos. Like and subscribe. Peace out.